Bond is denied for a man charged with murdering seven-year-old Jaslyn Adams. Tonight, we're learning new information about what police say was his role in the killing and who else may be involved. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jackie Bang. And I'm Taman Bradley. Kelly Davis is live with our top story tonight at 5. Kelly. Good evening, Taman and Jackie. Marion Lewis appeared in court virtually this morning for his bond hearing. As you mentioned, it was denied, and the state's attorney released some new details about exactly what unfolded one week ago today. The judge called it, quote, disturbing, to say the least. No keys back in the shack. A small group gathers outside McDonald's one week after seven-year-old Jaslyn Adams was murdered. It hurts me to see our children dying because I have a daughter myself. No justice, no peace. The young girl's death has rocked the city's west side as kids cry out for change. Put the guys out. I want to live. Police arrested one suspect in connection to the murder. 18 year old Marion Lewis faces more than a dozen felony charges, including first degree murder and attempted murder. What happened? Something happened. From the time you were born to 18, 18, you're still a baby. Still a baby. Something happened. Lewis was arrested Thursday after police say he led them on a chase down 290, then crashed into a median and tried to carjack another family's vehicle. Both those weapons that were on his person that were recovered, uh, they did test positive to the murder weapons used at the scene to kill Jaslyn. During today's bond hearing, the state's attorney said Lewis was driving the car involved in the shooting. They say the 18-year-old was behind the wheel when two other suspects got out and fired several rounds into Jaslyn Adams' family car. Police have identified the two other men, but they are not yet in custody. You can run, but you can't hide. We are going to bring you to justice for this crime. The Adams family deserves nothing less. Jaslyn's family has asked the others involved in the young girl's death to turn themselves in, but police are confident they'll track them down. That baby was innocent. These babies are being robbed of their innocence. Seven years old, no chance, no chance. Yes. Lewis's next court appearance is scheduled for this Thursday. Live at 26th in California, I'm Kelly Davis, WGN News.